Surely you must have seen this engine somewhere in the village or in the city and his voice will be heard. So today we will give you very useful information about the engine. When was the engine invented and what fuel does it use? And what are the reasons of its extinctions? So let's start. Welcome to Auto Mechanic 3D channel. Subscribe our channel for interesting and informative videos. This engine is called oil engine and the furnace oil or heavy oil is used as fuel. Hornsby acquired oil engine was most successful internal combustion engine that used heavy oil or furnace oil as fuel. Initially, internal combustion engine used gasoline as fuel. Gasoline is highly combustible material. That's why there was a lot of restrictions on its storage and its transportation. Kerosene oil was used as domestic fuel and lighting purpose only. Engineers faced many problems when heavy oil was used as fuel in internal combustion engine. Such oil was to be used as a fuel that could easily be converted into vapors. After much experimentations, it was decided to use heavy oil or furnace oil as fuel in internal combustion engines. Finally, on July 18, 1892, the first oil engine was sold commercially in which pressurized fuel injection system was used for the first time. This engine was the most popular engine from year 1805 to 1905. 32,417 engines were produced during this period. Many copies of this design were produced around the world. Later, Tractors and locomotives were also produced using this engine. This engine was also used to light the Taj Mahal. This engine is used in Pakistani heavy and small home-based industries. The starting of this engine is bit difficult. It was usually cranked by hand. In winter season, a little heat is also given to start this engine, so that the engine can be started easily and quickly. Heat is applied to the combustion chamber and nozzle area which accelerates the conversion of fuel into vapors and makes the engine start easily. Special care should be taken while operating this engine. This should be thoroughly checked before starting. Like the cooling system is working properly and the coolant level is full. There is a chance of engine overheating and seizing. Check mechanical parts for loose nuts, bolts or screws. Otherwise, there is a risk of serious damage due to vibration like breaking of the engine body or separation of flywheel from the engine. This can cause loss of injury and property. Now we will study the main parts of oil engine, engine body, Cylinder block, flywheel, camshaft, crankshaft, governor, fuel injector, fuel storage tank, auto lubricator, valve mechanism, cooling pipe and exhaust pipe. We hope you like this video. Please like and share our video and subscribe our channel so that we can bring you more informative videos.